Hey guys, happy Monday to everyone. So in this video, I'm going to show you on how to install Wireshark Packet Capture application. So what is it exactly? So it is a packet capture utility that helps us in capturing data packets uh, from your uh, office computer to the office, to your office. So whatever uh, data packets are uh, in transit that gets captured on this Wireshark application. And uh, Wireshark is often regarded as the most used packet sniffer in the world. Okay. And if you're a network security administrator or a network administrator, it's very important for you to learn and master Wireshark utility. All right. Having said that, if you're also planning to uh, do a CCNA certification or CCNP certification, Cisco Certified Network Associate, as well as Cisco Certified Network Professional Certifications, uh, learning Wireshark would be a very prudent move for you. All right. So in the next part of this video or uh, next, next part of this uh, Wireshark topic, I would be covering all the basics on how to use uh, Wireshark utility uh, with all the filters that it has to capture and analyze the data packets uh, within a network. Okay, so that is uh, that I'm going to cover in the next uh, part of the video, next section of the video. For now, in this video, we are just going to see the uh, whole installation procedure. It's very simple, guys, and it's open source application. It's not a, uh, it does not come at a, at a costed uh, rate. It's completely free, free of cost. Anyone can use it. So let me quickly begin with the installation. I have just opened Chrome browser in front of you, and I'm just going to type Wireshark um, install or I can say download for Windows all right and on a Kali Linux uh, operating system it comes by default I mean it's a pre-installed application so you need not manually go ahead and install it on your Kali Linux virtual box but in Windows it does not come in handy or uh, pre-installed we need to install it manually so I'm going to select the first very first link from the official Wireshark page and I'm just going to select the Windows installer 64 bit all right and it's getting downloaded in front of you it's around 75 meg data file just going to open the downloaded file downloaded installer it's just the executable rather a MSI and I'm just going to say next and then I will just scroll down this slider to the bottom and I just say noted alright and I'm just going to say next again it will and I can just also say put a check mark on the uh, Wireshark desktop icon and also I can put a check mark on Wireshark quick launch icon and I'm just going to say next to uh, to this to all the pop-ups or the messages that appear I'm just going to say um, I'm just going to ignore this part here install USB P, uh, capture and I'm just going to say next all right the installation is going to take some time maybe a minute or so but it's happening very fast out there all right so I'm just going to skip this part here so the installation is still happening I'm just going to pause this video for a while for it to complete and give me a message finished and uh, in the transit of the installation I'm getting this pop-up I will just say agree to it this is the uh, end user license agreement All right and I'm just going to say I'm not going to select any of these options and I'm just going to say install and the installation has begun further and I'm again going to pause it for a while so the progress bar uh, has completed the installation and it has given me the message installation complete and that's it I'm just going to give a next over here and uh, I'm just going to say finish and still it's doing something out here it's installing some DLL files and I'm going to quickly pause again so guys that's again uh, it has completed the installation and uh, it's just giving me the finish option and that's it guys it has uh, successfully installed this on my machine 
right i'm just going to quickly search it and you can see here i just share searched using the wire term and it has given me the options under the programs menu so this is the entire installation procedure if you like this video please hit the upvote button and in the coming video i will show on how to use it all the basics of using it and uh, and we'll meet in the next video thank you so much for watching this video